All right, so we're going to show you a quick video. Uh, we've talked a bit about two very important elements of sexual wellness and health. One being a psychological component, the other being a physical component. So today we're going to dive into uh, a little bit more about the company and what we do and what we believe in. And to get started, I'll show this little video. Intercourse for me was almost like... Um, I didn't feel much, right? It was like this void. <laughs> and uh, uh, having doing the program and during the whole uh, process, um, um, I would say I felt some changes, but not initially. And I think more towards the end of the um, uh, the treatment, um, like uh, the last two months or so. Uh, things have just like changed, <laughs> totally. A very good experience. I mean, um, I've mentioned uh, before during the treatment, it feels like I'm a 20 year old, um, you know, in, this, uh, in the sexual part of things. So um, it's really done, it's boosted my confidence a lot um, going through the treatment. There was no pain. I didn't feel a slight discomfort, but it's not awkward. Um, it was actually very, it's bearable, uh, maybe it's a strong use to it, but it was fine. It was easy going, very relaxed. Um, I didn't have any concerns with it, yeah. So with the physical changes I've noticed, there's definitely lubrication, lubrication, <laughs> lubrication. Uh, there's, it's, it's much better. Um, very sensitive, so um, it's definitely more enjoyable. <laughs> yes. Incontinence, yeah, that's it. So I had there's definitely a huge change there. <laughs> I would recommend it to anyone. Um, I, I can honestly say I'm so thankful for the treatment because <laughs> just what it has done for me and changed my my behavior, even wanting to um, have sexual intercourse, I was at a point where I didn't feel the interest, um, you know, wondering if my husband felt like good with me as well. and. Um, it, it's really changed a lot for me. So I can highly recommend that for anyone that has maybe that similar issue. It, it can be that, um, we used the word earlier, an, an elephant in the room if you don't have that comfortability with your husband anymore. Um, so I would highly recommend it. And just from his perspective as well, because we've had a, a chat after the treatment to say, you know, does he, does he feel a difference? And he, he, can, he can definitely feel a difference. My husband knew nothing about it. Like he just knew that I was going to a clinic, and he didn't want to know about you know girl stuff and stuff. Right so it, it was great. So because it, it had it started. Okay. So uh, instead of showing the whole second half of the video, because we're a little short on time, you are welcome to come watch it or come talk to us, and we'll share it with you. But these are real patients. They're patients from one of our clinics up in Calgary, Dr. Allen. Uh, who's treated over 200 patients, and these are two of them. This is unscripted. In fact, uh, in one of the videos, you can hear the uh, person interviewing her saying, uh-huh, uh-huh, because it's like very, very fascinating. Uh, but what you may or may not have heard her say was how this has improved her relationship with her husband. Not just the physical element, which was great, but the communication that they're talking about this, that they're uh, they're sharing more discussion about what they like, what they don't like. Uh, and she said it really saved her marriage. They hadn't touched each other in a very long time. So, you know, those are real patient testimonials, and be happy to share more with you. And I know um, Cutis and Dr. Sylvia have their own testimonials that they could definitely give you from some of their patients. But just to give you an idea of, of how this is really having an impact. So my name is Caitlin Farrell. Uh, I'm the Global Director of Business Development for Viviv. And what I do is I travel around the world to our various clinics and I work with their staff, I work with the physicians, and I work with patients to have more open discussion about this. Because I know it's very difficult sometimes for us to bring this up with our physician. We're almost waiting for them to ask us about it uh, and let us know whether or not we have an issue. So um, I work with them and I kind of see what's going on and I have a lot of uh, interviews with patients and, and staff on what's really, um, what's really going on in this space. But to tell you a bit more about the company, Viviva is a women's uh, health company or a global health company. Uh, we are working on a non-ablative medical device to remodel collagen and restore vaginal tissue. Um, and really what that's about is more the device that Dr. Sylvia was talking about earlier. Uh, we are a team of people who are very passionate about women's health and wellness. 
Uh, we're passionate about patient education and empowerment. And part of what I do is working with clinics to help educate the patients on this issue. Anything from anatomy to you know, talking about it more freely to um, exploring other uh, areas to to open up interest in the topic. Um, we are internationally patented technology, which is very important. We do robust clinical science, and we are very uh, we are experiencing enthusiastic acceptance around the world. You know, this is some of the parts of the country we are in. We're also now in the U.S. Uh, and which is where our company is based, but we have been treating patients all over the world. Our CEO, as part of being a women's health company, we have a female CEO, her name is Pat Scheller, um, and she has over 25 years experience in a medical device, and uh, along with Pat, some of our senior leadership, um, and most of the, uh, well, if not all of the people at our company, have experience in medical device, the medical realm, everything from Boston Scientific to Whole Logic uh, to Johnson & Johnson. But for each of these companies and for each of the individuals that works at Viviv, we are invested in her health, safety, and overall wellness. So we always put our patients first. Uh, we make sure that the science is good, that it's been tested, and that safety is a priority. Um, you will find there are a lot of treatments out there for uh, they may claim sexual function or are doing a certain element uh, um, in this area, and it's really important to do your research and educate yourself on what you're, what you're doing and what treatment you're about to, uh, to go into. Make sure that there's clinical data, make sure that there's research, make sure that the people who work for the company or the manufacturer are solid. You know, investigate the clinics you work with. You're all here tonight, presumably because you trust Cutis, you have been to them before for other treatments, and you trust their opinion on a new device. So one of the things we are introducing this year is Genevieve. So the device itself is called Vivive, but the treatment is called Genevieve. Uh, and the reason we did that was to help, help patients understand uh, the treatment a little bit better, to kind of give her a, a human personality. And the way to do that is sort of who is Genevieve, right? It's a, it's a name, it's a person. You know, we all kind of aspire to be a Genevieve. We think about who she is. She's happy, she's fulfilled, she's, confident, she's, uh, she's many things that we all aspire to be, but life can sometimes get in the way. And what is Genevieve looking for, right? What is it that, uh, that she wants in life or she wants out of this treatment? And so one of those things is self-improvement and physical wellness, right? We're looking to improve ourselves. We're looking to be as healthy as can be. We're looking for the best innovation in health and fitness. Uh, maybe we're looking for better intimacy and closeness with our partner. Uh, we're really investing in our relationship. Or maybe life is in, tr is in transition and there's an opportunity to do something new. Um, and it's funny, in all the places we go, the most interesting thing is that a lot of women identify with, with this uh, perspective, that they're, the kids have maybe gone off to college and there's more opportunity to re-engage with your partner and be intimate with your partner again, or maybe you know, newly separated, or uh, something has changed where she's able to take care of herself. And we've, we've talked a lot tonight about self-love and self-awareness, and the most important thing out of all of this is that you have to take care of yourself first. You have to make sure that everything's working here before you can worry about your relationship or anything beyond that. Um, so that's a little bit about who we are. And again, it was a fast presentation because we had limited time. But again, if you're interested in more patient testimonials or to know a little bit more about the company and what we do, please feel free to talk to uh, myself or Jeff Sinclair, who is our director for Asia, is in the back. We'd be happy to answer questions. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kathleen, for sharing about uh, Genevieve and Vivi.